Welcome to technical drawing. Today we are going to draw this sum in oblique. First we will draw a box. See origin is over here. Length is 50. Diameter of the circle. So we will mark 50. Height will be also 50. 50. Height is also 50. Width is 40. So we'll take 45 degree. Remember that we are taking receding angle at 45 degree. You can take 30 or 60 degree also. It depends upon the question. So I'm taking 45 degree and then you mark 40 on that. And you complete the box. If they haven't mentioned anything in exam, you can take receding angle. 45 degree this is front view where we will draw a circle but if you see there is a dark line that means there are two circles there are two parts and if you see side view there is only one shape see this L shape so if you see circle it's divided into two parts and side view is one part so we'll start with side view we'll take 10 we'll go down from here we'll go down how much is the height 25 so we'll come down by 25 then we'll draw horizontal line from here also horizontal horizontal how much will take 50 50 50 so we are we are done with that box right after that from center See this, this semicircle will come here, half semicircle will go behind. After that you take center and from there you can cut 15 and 25 radius. Join this dark, then you take this line behind, see this, this half circle is done, then we'll take this behind, this center will be behind, let's say this is A, so then you go behind by 30 and you mark point. B. See this. This is A and this is B. So from B also now you take radius 15 and 25 and draw half circle. See how do you know that there are like there are two semicircles. If you see the main diagram you will see a dark line at the center. So that indicates that it is divided into two parts. See this upper half and lower half so we are done with this much now we need to give width this will be also dark now if you see this is width how much it goes behind 40 total is 40 right from a it is 40 and from b it is 10 so what we'll do from b will mark 10 Let's say that is point C and from point C we'll draw radius 25 and 15 also. First we'll draw radius 25. From C we'll cut 25. 
See this. And we can draw tangent like this. Now we take radius 15 and from C you draw this. This is to show the behind circle, you know, it's a depth, right? So it will be seen, it's like a polo circle. This is 45 degree, which is receding angle and you can do dimensioning. Thank you.